Hi, in this video you will learn about Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC 2021. We will discuss what is special about this system, how to download and install it on your computer for testing, to compare its performance with the usual Windows 10 Home. Is LTSC faster than other versions? We will find out from the results of experiments. One of them, by the way, is new about FPS in games. So watch to the end, a lot of effort has been invested in this release. There will be exclusive information. And now subscribe if you haven't done so yet and let's start. First I would like to remind you what Windows LTC is. Perhaps you have not yet seen the previous videos on our channel where it was mentioned. The full name of this release is Windows 10 Enterprise LTC. Enterprise means it is intended for use in devices in production where stability, reliability, security and of course performance are important. And the abbreviation LTSC, Long Term Service Channel, means that this version will receive security updates longer than other versions, including the regular Enterprise one. And earlier, for example, in 2020, we did tests and it was clearly noticeable how much more productive this version was compared to the usual Home and Pro versions. However, after a year and a half, the situation is already changing, further you will see in more detail. The main documentary difference between the LTSC 2021 version is the absence of many applications built into the system. There is no Microsoft Store, Skype, widgets and various other small applications and services which are in the other versions. There is no even a regular image viewer, only paint. You can see for yourself, everything is minimalistic here and you can install everything you need yourself, this is not a problem. But how to install Windows 10 LTC 2021 on your PC? There is a page on the Microsoft website where you can download a trial version of both this release and Windows 11 LTC, but this is a theme for another video. We choose ISO LTC, fill out the form, just enter information about yourself. If you do not have a company, you can write that you have one employee. Continue, select the bit x64, your language, other languages you can choose after installation. And that's all, the image is downloaded to your computer. It is worth noting that Microsoft doesn't recommend that we try this system on a home PC, but it doesn't prohibit it either. But if you want to purchase a license for Windows LTC and use it on your home computer, this is not permitted by the license terms. To burn the ISO image to a USB flash drive, I use the Rufus program. Reboot and start from the flash drive. And here everything is the same as when installing any Windows 10. And now the system is ready to work, it is also good to update it to the latest versions. In the lower right corner, a message indicates that this is a trial version. You will also see how many days are left. This is usual 90 days. After that, there will be such an inscription and the PC will turn off abruptly after an hour of work. These 90 days can be extended several times with the following command, which must be written in the command line. Do not forget to open it as administrator, so you can use this version for almost a whole year. Now let's move on to the most interesting theme. Let's test the performance in this system compared to other versions of Windows. So now you will see the results of 6 experiments, all participant system with the latest updates installed from scratch on a real PC. The computer on which the tests were carried out is based on the Intel Core i7-3612QM processor, it has 8GB of RAM and a HDD disk. And first test is benchmarks. These are special programs that load the processor with calculations and evaluate their performance with points. First benchmark is SignBench R23. Let's run it several times on each system to reduce the error and take the largest reading. Here are the results. Usual Windows 10 21H2 Home received 2504 points and Windows 10 LTSC 2021 2499. 
The difference is within the margin of error. Earlier in the same experiment, Windows 10 LTSC 2019 gained more than other systems. Well, let's take our time with conclusions and run another benchmark, Prime 95. It acts a little differently, but it also gives the processor different tasks and detects the speed of its execution, how many iterations per second the processor performs. Here we can compare the results of Windows 10 Home and LTSC 2021. Each line is a separate test and you can line by line compare the first line with the first, the second with the second, etc. What conclusion can be drawn for these results? In different tests, two systems are almost on a pair. One somewhere breaks ahead, then the other. But everything is within the margin of error. I tried in all benchmarks to find the most quiet state of the system, so that other background processes do not interfere. But still, Windows is a multitasking system. A lot of these tasks are sent to the processor every second, so there is some error. But in this experiment something else is interesting. We see equality here, which means that Microsoft has improved the performance of the home version. In addition, if we compare with the indicators of the 7 or, or previous versions of Windows 10, then in this benchmark the current version of 21H2 shows better results. Let's confirm or deny these conclusions in the next test. If you haven't seen our past tests yet, take a look, you might be interested. And second one, conversion. Perhaps you have doubts about the reliability of the benchmarks because they have an error, therefore it is worth checking their results on a real task. We will convert a video file from one format to another and note the time it takes to complete the task on each system. This process involves a processor and a video card. We have converted several times and recorded the best results. Windows 10 Home showed the best conversion time 3 minutes and 49 seconds and Windows 10 LTC 3 minutes and 47. This is almost the same time and the results of the first test are confirmed. And so are our findings. These values correspond to the result of a fast Windows 8 embedded and overtake the 7, Windows 10 LTSB and even more so Windows 10 21 H1. Interesting. Note also that Windows 10 21 H2 began to show such results only after the full December updates. Something has been improved and moreover in our favor. Like it if you are surprised at Microsoft's progress. The third test – Task Manager. Now let's start comparing how the LTC 2021 system uses RAM. And the Task Manager will show us how much memory Windows takes for processing at idle. To do this, after turning on the PC, we wait a few minutes until the system comes to a stable state and starts freeing memory, closing unnecessary services. The results are as follows. Windows 10 Home uses 2 GB of RAM while 144 processes are running. Windows 10 LTC uses 1.4 GB and there are 124 processes. And here we see the advantage of the enterprise version, which is quite logical, it doesn't have a lot of built-in applications that are in the usual time. And this prompted the idea to make a video on how to turn Windows 10 Home or Pro versions into LTC. When this video is ready, there will be links here and in the description. The fourth test – Application Launch. This test shows how the operating system uses RAM and disk when it launches an application and loads data from disk into RAM. To do this, as usual, we will use the free photo editor GIMP. I wonder if there will be a difference between the systems. As usual, we did some tests on each system and now you will see the fastest. Let's go! In Windows 10 LTSC and in Windows 10 Home, programs run almost the same, in 22-23 seconds. For comparison earlier, the LTSB 2016 launched the same program in the same conditions in 28 seconds and the Windows 10 Home in 34 seconds. 
We were still unhappy with how Windows 10 uses memory. And now, finally, when version 11 came out, Microsoft upgraded the 10s. But still they don't reach the speed of 7s and 8s in this test. The fifth test – FPS in games. This is a new test, please rate it and share your impressions in the comments. We have installed the game suitable for this computer, Anno 2070, and now you can see the FPS figures in the home version and enterprise version. Judging by the previous tests, they shouldn't be different, but let's see. As you can see, the performance is really on par, both during peak loads and in quieter moments for the PC. The sixth test – the occupied disk space. This doesn't affect performance, but just out of curiosity. Let's compare how long each Windows folder takes up. Windows 10 Home After Updates weights 16GB and the same folder in 10's LTC 13GB before updates, but much more after. So, what conclusions can we draw after all these tests? Today, the performance of the Windows 10 Enterprise LTC 2021 is the same as the regular version. Which means that you cannot worry about anything if you use a Windows 10 Home or Professional and have the latest updates. It is important that the system is licensed. This will give security and hence stability. And if you follow the optimization tips from our channel, your system will run as fast as possible. Thanks for watching this video, it seems to have turned out interesting and the conclusions change our idea. We are proceeding to the preparation of the release on the transformation of any edition of Windows into the look of the LTC, but for now watch our other videos. See you on there!